All right, what's up, Airborns, and welcome back to Steel Division Normandy 44. I figured I would play the first mission of the Mission Boston campaign today, which is a four campaign, four mission campaign, not four campaign mission, four mission campaign in Steel Division regarding the 82nd Airborne, which is a bit weird because they're not actually in the game. They decided to pick the 101st. Now, obviously, they didn't you know, make two airborne divisions because there would be no difference really between the 82nd and 101st minus like some, you know, patches and maybe like one or two different units. Anyway, the campaign spans the 82nd airborne quest through at least the beginning part of Normandy. And the first mission is actually a mission that I kind of played a little bit. It was the very first thing that I even played in the entire game. And I definitely felt like I wasn't up for it. So somehow I thought it was a good idea to start with the second campaign, which is obviously, and was actually quite a hard. Um, now the Operation Epsom campaign, I've heard stuff about it. It's really, really hard. So I guess that we'll get to that one obviously last. But for now, let's jump into Hetero Hell. Hope you guys enjoy. Check out my Steel Division Normandy playlist in the description for more multiplayer, the single player Atlantic Wall campaign, or for some battle group reviews. But for now, let's jump in. Last night, American and Allied airborne forces boarded their planes and took off towards France. Shortly after midnight this morning, and despite the German anti-aircraft defenses, our boys set foot behind enemy lines in Normandy. Meantime, at dawn, the greatest armada ever assembled opened fire and proceeded to land assault troops on the shores of France. The liberation of Europe is underway as we speak. Both airborne divisions have been blown to the four winds all over the Cotentin Peninsula. Let's hope it'll disorganize the Germans as we planned. Half the men have been misdropped, sir, including ourselves. We seem to have landed at the boundaries between our 82nd and the 101st. Way too far from the division's objectives at St. Mariglise and the bridges over the Merdere River. Yet, we aren't the only ones completely off mark. The first amphibious assault wave has just hit the beach right on schedule, but much further south than planned. That is just east of our present position. That's not a bad thing. New orders from Division HQ, sir. You are placed in charge of a provisional task force, gathering any isolated paratroopers in the area, whatever their unit, and securing Eau de Ville La Hubert to allow our ground force to exit the beach as quickly as possible. The city and vicinities are held by a mere company of infantry. We must seize it as quickly as possible and put Eau de Ville in a state of defense to repel any attempts by the Germans to recapture it, and then counterattack quickly to open the way. The German coastal defenses are manned by auxiliary troops of poor military value, but they are supported by heavy guns. Any help we could provide in destroying those guns would hasten the amphibious forces advance inland. Right, so I did lie to you because there's apparently also 101st. So I got 82nd Airborne over here. I don't know if they're actually 82nd or if they're just, you know, still 101st. But I got, so I got 82nd Airborne over here. We've got 101st over here. And over here we have the D-Day, I guess, beach invasion landing. It's already happened. They're just, uh... Pushing off the beach, or actually, you know, they're quite far there. I mean, there's not too much area in between. There's like one, two, three, three-ish big hedgerows over on that side, and 
like one, two, three, four, five big as well, not big ones over there. Not that bad. All right, so I'm not going to go over the whole composure battle group situation thing. I've already explained it multiple times in a German one. And by this point, if you really know what, what I'm doing, you probably should check out one of my earlier uh, skirmish videos or or single player videos or one of my multiplayer videos or deck building videos because it isn't really important for me right now to figure out um, what I'm doing. Although I'm pretty sure I can't really... Oh, I can do I can change. Okay, that's good. Let's just fucking change this to just Pathfinders. Uh, although an M20... Oh, let's face B, though. Well, nah, one M20 wouldn't be bad. Okay, let's see. Artillery. We got A phase mortars, B phase mortars, and C B phase that. Anti-tank. Uh, we don't need any bazookas because our guys have a T on them. So, you need to really shut the fuck up. Yeah, he, this guy looks like a uh, famous actor. Like, he looks like a guy from... Uh, he, look, he looks like an older guy from Saving Private Ryan. Um, I'm, like, slapping my head. I can't remember his name. Ugh. Oh. I'm such an asshole. Uh, I, I know exactly. It, it, no, actually, it looks like a mixture of the guy from Saber Private Ryan and that guy from Fury and the Walking Dead. Uh, well, I don't want to spoil anything, so I guess I can't really say what, what either of those two characters are because I know that well, I, I can't say anything about that without spoiling anything. Damn it. Anyway, uh, so we have good AT guns in Phase A, which is important. We have the 57 mil here, and we got the... I mean, ADP isn't that bad. And then for support, we have the G50 cal, Jeep Supply. I could potentially take out uh, 5,000. No, that's enough supply. Anyway, uh, let's jump in. I could potentially just delete this card and get another card of the supply. Okay, let's go. So uh, let's jump in. And actually, now I have a clue what I'm doing. Because the very first time I was playing this, I was like totally hopeless, obviously. I had no clue what I was doing. I was like, what? what is this unit? What is this unit? Can I not? We're paratroopers. Oh, you're not movable? To be oh. Any orders? Okay, well, you're not movable, which kind of sucks, but I guess we'll do fine. Any orders? We have bazookas and all these guys, which is awesome. Uh, recon, you're going to move to that tree line here, here, and then over here. We should probably stick up and get at least one mortar on either side. And a mortar and a jeep supply. And over here we have two mortars and a jeep supply, which is good. Uh, we have these pathfinders. We're gonna these guys are gonna run in here and run in there. Gonna go behind them, go in a building, and here we have a whole squad of units. Go, 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 go. Actually, more like more like this, I guess. That's not a bad idea, necessarily. And then we have... Wait, where is our two things for you? There you go. And then anti-tank. Not really needed right now. I could get some engineers with the flamers. Those would actually not be bad. And then a leader on this side would not be bad either, considering they need one for the veterancy. And then I guess I can roll down an AT gun if I really need one. Okay, let's go. Let's move them up. Let's move this up. Let's move it up. Move it out. It's all good. Move you out. So like I said, the uh, beach invasion has started over here. We got a shit ton of B-26s is going to be dropping bombs over here. I'm actually running this at quite decent frames considering the size and scale of this fight. There's howitzers. There's 88s back here. How are they? Oh, they're just bombing the shit out of that. Okay. More marauders over there. Okay, so we gotta figure out where these guys are. Uh, I have led this mission for like what I don't know, two, five minutes. I, didn't, I never even saw the inside of their town, so really don't know what to expect here, honestly. So we can try and push this up. The mortar needs to be ready though, because I'm expecting like an MG somewhere, and obviously this is actually a really hard first mission because you're doing it on two flanks if that makes sense like you're attacking on two sides it's a bit of a rough first mission you ask me i totally forgot that this was uh actually not the easiest mission in the world i'll be there soon yes sir smoke these up gotta keep that mortar 
far forward because it only has like 900 meter range. It's absolutely nothing. That's a uh, armored car. Don't have any AT over here. Kind of was an oversight on my end. I mean, I have bazookas, but. I'm still pushing and let's go. Oh, I totally forgot about these guys this time. Damn it. This is a rough mission. Like, I mean, I've played quite a lot of this game, but like, having to kind of micro two fronts at the same time, or, well, I mean, a flank over here and a flank over there, and then you got those guys set up over there, and you couldn't even control where they were going. It's kind of frustrating. Uh, move this up. He just said easy company, didn't he? Oh god. Get in the houses. We're operating. It's gotta okay, I don't know why I mortared I smoked that, but anyway. You can probably just charge these guys in that building anyway. Oh no, don't surrender! Oh god, I just fucking pinned them down at the same time. That was really lucky. Although there's a leader in the, in the range too, so... Okay, good. That was a bit of the bad side. I almost lost my uh, Pathfinders. I really didn't think they would have a time to react to the... Um, to that at all, honestly. Did not think they had any time for that. That's totally an oversight on my behalf. These guys haven't been killed. Okay, they're just gonna surrender. Hit this unit. Keep pushing up. At your order. Not too much time left. Definitely not easy to be sitting here the entire time. Oh, get back a little bit more. Open fire, mortars moving up. Makes you wish you had a... Any... Oh, I do, I do have... I don't, oh, man. This is a, this is a hard... Like, it feels hard. Um, let's move them up. Let's get the leader pushing up. Let's push this up. Scouts report locating one of the field batteries showing the beach, sir. The beach surrounded. I might have to send two units in a recon over there to find that uh, secondary objective somewhere back here. Forgot where it is. Okay, there's just like over here. Okay, I can just send those rifles over there and deal with them. And then the cheap 50 can actually do lots of damage. And then push this up. And then remember, dealing with a shit ton of guys over here. But we can make these guys surrender. Yep, there you go. I mean, they're still they're still airborne. I mean, they're not gods, but they're definitely not shit. Probably should send that mortar over here, actually, but it's going to be really, really slow. But I could should have, have that mortar over there to support the, uh... Ready to pound them, sir. Okay, flamers, where are you going? Pathfinder's good. Hey, Tegan might as well stay here, because that's where they're going to be approaching from when I have to defend. We're pretty... Okay, at least we connected the lines now. That really matters anything, but hey, at least we did so. This guy's in the house. Yet, Major. Keep oh, yeah. Come on, we should be able to... Shit. Don't shoot, let them burn. I love that. They're gonna be suppressed in a second. It's really shitty. Let's uh, mortar or smoke that house. Smoke these up. Smoke this up. There are these houses over here. I am listening, sir. Keep this all up while we're kind of just running through this hedgerow country back here without really any resistance. Probably Q move those guys just to be sure. My flamers have a good point of view now. Put them in the house. Flame those fucking bitches down. Make them surrender. There we go. Secured. We should bring MGs and AT guns to ambush any German reinforcements. Bring up a 76 or a 57, sorry, not a 76. 50 cal has not even done its job really. It didn't really do anything, I think. There we go. It's so cheap, but it, wait, it works, then it works, right? Okay, let's get the mortar back here. 
Let's get this over here. Let's uh, start hurrying this fucking show up. Let's go to this guy's over here. Let's key move him just to be sure. There's still some guns back here. I really don't care about these mortars anymore. I'll probably do without them anyway. And worst case scenario, I'll bring up uh, uh, what's it called? The howitzer to deal with those units. Okay, well now we need some more pathfinders. Let's get another one or squad of pathfinders and a machine gun or two. And a leader. No, actually, we're going to leaders, I think. What would be a good spot? Like right... Ooh, that's a great spot. They're coming down that road. I am in charge here. So put that over here. Airborne rifles in there. Ready to blast some tanks, sir. Put these guys in here. Gun, sir. We're working on this. We're working on this. Okay, we secured this back part. Let's not really deal with... Whatever is over here, whether there's something over there or not, I really don't care. I just want to make sure it's this defense up quite fast. Is there a church over here in this town? Uh, am I missing this? Is there supposed to be a church? Or is there a church here at all? I don't think I can see one really quickly right now, so let's assume there's not one. Okay, the engineers need to go close to the front. Pathfinders over here. Now we're coming into contact over here. We're really going to need something to deal with these guys. Probably should have brought a flamethrower squad over here, but, you know, what do you do? Okay, uh, Okay. I need to set up these guys, actually, before I go crazy. Set up here. Keep supply here. Mortars moving in. Recon. I might as well put one recon behind us. Fucking, you never know what they're going to send them at me, do you? Uh, put these guys in the front. Put these guys over here. These are going to make short work of them, I'm sure. I mean, they do have a lot of firepower. I mean, they do have an MG and an MP40, but I have my full squad firing at those guys. So I'm very much assuming I can win that fight. These Pathfinders... I don't know. Uh, let's unload these machine guns. This is a decent line of sight. Let's actually replace this house with another machine gun. And then we got a leader there, we got a leader here. It's probably the actually leader. I am in charge here. Ah shit. Move out, man. Yes, sir. No, go out, get out. Get in here. Move. Move down. I got what? 30 seconds left, okay. Okay, we're gonna queue move these guys. Find an artillery unit. Make sure we clear this out first. There's. Don't tell me this is actually gonna fire at me, is it? I got two squads firing. They do have a 30 cal. Is this thing gonna fire at me? It's doing some weird stuff back there. Really don't want that thing to be firing at me. At least the 30 cal is making its hurry. Um, I guess we'll have, have this in like the final, I guess we'll have this like back here. It's not a bad spot for an AT gun necessarily. Enemy column in sight. We must stop them. Probably, well, these guys are okay, I guess. Flamers. Put this over here. Pathfinders. Sure, we have eyes on this road over here. Any orders? Let's get a big howitzer here to engage that. Ready, sir. What are being pinned down? We'll move these guys up. Actually, I had one of these squads still fell, still firing while these guys are moving up. And then we have two more uh, batteries over there we have to deal with. Okay, these guys totally just got taken out. They're never going to survive that, which really sucks. They're just going to be taken out in the fight. And these guys can't fire right now. For some reason, we're on a re Oh yeah, I forgot! 500 meter range, because fuck the allies versus the Germans, right? Fucking 500 meter range versus 800 meter range, that makes sense. That's the only thing that's really triggering me in this game. I should just get a 50 cal in that house and just get it over with. Set these in here. 
And I have like a second machine gun coming up. Ready, sir. Howitzer's here. Alright, let's deal with this stuff. If we just kill the, if we just kill the a, artillery, we could at the very least steal the ammo truck and then just resupply these guys with ammo, which would be nice. Let's charge them down, make them surrender. Fifty cal is coming in. Might as well put a fifty cal down this road. Uh, anti tank. Don't really need these right now. I could get a. Uh, I mean, I could get a big howitzer. I don't want to get the ammo truck for this. It would be nice to get that. If it still works. It does. I mean, it still has ammo in it, that's what I mean. We supply those guys. This is going to get killed. Put this in there. We'll get the second 50 cal. Coming from over here, if it's possible. Yeah, it is possible. What's my cheap 50? That's okay. Uh, let's get Ready to film it, sir. Roger. Changing position. Let's move these up a little bit. Wait, for now they're not in a really great position. Anybody need ammo? Roger. Move these down over here, move these in over there, and then we're good. Is it Tegan's in a good spot? We got another fifty coming in. We're gonna be dealing with all that German equipment over there. Send this over here, and this is going to go back here and just act like a, another supply truck, I think. And then we'll just deal with this. Is there like more than just... It says there's still three guns. I mean, I have not been hitting this. Also, the Americans are getting around any direction. Not doing bad. Goes for 23 minutes. Jesus. That's a lot of time. Is there no leader near this unit? Because I'm going to get really mad. Switzerland should not die. No. You're not dying on me, you fucking booster. Okay, now there's at least units over here. Leaders over here now. It's just not... I was going to say, there should be leaders over here. Come on. Like there's, there, there's trolling and there's fucking trolling. Now let's get cooking. This should be. Wait, is this a zero star? Oh, it is a zero star. Okay. I love that fucking. I love when I sing in this game. It's so cool. For one second, I thought that was a, a Nebel Werfer, but it's my fucking mortar spam. Hmm. What happened here? Take a look at that in a second. We're done dealing with these guys. 50's doing good. Is this truck still mine? Or did that truck actually get surrendered? Oh, the truck might have surrendered to something along the way. Okay, well, we're doing good so far. Let's uh, switch out. Okay, put... You're definitely going to sit there anymore. I don't know where I'll put you. Put you in there. Nah, that'll be bad too. Let's put you in there if I really need to. Well, what happened over in this tree line over here? Like, my guys died. There must be like an MG or... Anyway, let's kill these guns. Kill the gunner, please. There you go. Alright, he's to silence the guns. That's good. But it says three guns remaining over there. Let's, go. Let's charge him down. Hopefully we can make him surrender. Even though, I don't know if they'll be behind enemy lines or not. Push him down again. It's not really nice, but... It works. I guess I'm kind of need another squad to come in over here. Is not a gun? Jesus. Maybe the gun turn around, the initial gun turn around or something, and like killed 
my guys or something? Like the gun, the actual gun turnaround? God damn it! We must destroy them or they will eat our tanks for breakfast. Okay. Well. Nothing's moving there anymore. It's not really hard to do that though. There you go. Any orders? Choose your target. Trying to move these mortars up enough where I can actually fire at something would be great. Okay, that mortar, that thing is really fucking annoying, those, that mortar battery. Have to work on that in a second. Then we'll work on these guys as well. Oh, there's a 20 mil, that's what's been killing me. Why does it still have a secondary objective marker over here? I mean, I'll go kill more guns. Definitely don't go there, though. What's this? A little AT gun? I'll kill it. Alright. Kill the pack. That's the pack I just saw. Glider rifles are not that great, but hey, with a starter, not that bad. Let's move these pathfinders up to over here somewhere. Oh shit. Don't fall back into the machine gun. Oh, it's just a recon. Okay, that's okay. We can we can make these guys kill those guns, even though it doesn't really need, well have to be done. I can still try. Oh, I think they stole back my uh I think, they, I think they stole well, they stole back their trucks. Fucking bastards. I don't think that would be in range of. I didn't think there would be a machine gun there. I mean, it's a good position, don't make me wrong. It's gonna keep hitting that position. It'll be suppressed in one second, and I can just run these guys down into there. If they even all make it. That border spam is horrible. Let's get these, these flamers to do their job. There we go. Don't shoot. Let them burn. Fire. Smash them. Damn it, I did not expect it to be that much stuff. He's burning. Waiting for fire core. Fire, triple fire battery, let's go! These flamethrowers are gonna get so many kills, man. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. There's a fucking machine gun right there. Keep hitting that. That building just got wrecked, though. I need a supply jeep. Alright, I'll get a duck, I guess. Man, these guys are getting fucking wrecked. Holy shit. Not weird. I mean, don't get me wrong. It makes sense, but it's still frustrating. I found some flax, anyway. Sure, we can deal with this. Come on. I push him out. Let's get a mortar them once or twice. So wait for the mortars to be done spamming their fucking shells and then... Oh my god, dude. Those fucking 88s are not fucking around. Nor is that... Nor are the guys in that building, because they're fucking dead. Okay, well we're dealing with these guys. Make sure we put these mortars a little bit back. Come 
Well, I was gonna make him surrender, but either or. Hitting that. Mortars are opening fire on that one. Fighter rifles can move up to the building. Pathfinders can move up. Duck can move up. Let's kill those fucking idiots, because those things are just destructive as all hell. Oh, great. And there's another one over there somewhere. I love doing this. Love being an RD spammer. Now we have the this avenue covered. There's definitely something over there, but we have it covered, so we should be fine. Only off schedule, sir. The tank should already be rolling towards St. Mary Glees. That's not my fault. We're operational. Direct hit. Where is the target here? Enemy spotted. Oh, there's another flak down. I mean there's like one left. Let's gotta find it. It's gonna be the hardest part. This bastard over here is firing at my artillery. I mean, he's far. I mean, it's good. That's good. Yeah, it's good in this. Send me wrong. I just don't know where the fucking booster went. Make sure we keep these guys leveled. Found the more found the eighty-eight. Enemy spotted. Roger. Whatever I do, I should not lose these mortars, because then I don't have access to the mortars in the next battle anymore. Well, we're hammering that thing. It's gonna die. Like there we go. All we gotta do is just go back, First and uh, so that means that these guys are not clear to move up. I don't know if I was supposed to save any of these tanks. There's a lot more coming. Eh, I'll probably be fine. The kids are ha hammering me with that fucking Fire. stuff over there, though. It, I, got it. I need that duck to get over here and give me ammo. Right there. On the road again. That's the entire area. Keep hitting that, please. There's not much left here, and I got these mortars moving up. We're just gonna hold for 12 minutes. These guys are getting wrecked. These flamethrowers back. These guys are getting wrecked. Got a shit ton of artillery for an airborne division. Don't have any, uh, don't have any, uh, like, planes, that'd be great, but they're probably all fucking busy on the invasion, I don't blame them. Yes, sir. Let's see what's over here, I want to kill this, because it says, like, there's still a secondary objective I haven't completed yet. Here comes all the friendly tanks, which is awesome we'll find them. that we found them. It's at least, uh, three, four, five, there's like six, seven, five, six, seven DDs over there. Are they firing at my mortars or something? Why aren't you more accurate, damn it? I love that the DDs are just destroying those people over there. And now we can kill this gun, even though we've already killed it, and I'm pretty sure... Is there an objectives thing anywhere? I can't... I don't know where there's an objectives thing, but I pretty much, like, already killed all of this. Anyway. There we go. That was weird. I definitely thought I killed those guns before, or at least it said something like that. Well, we're still dealing with the artillery spammers. I mean, I'm an artillery spammer myself right now doing this. Don't get me wrong. I kind of want to kill this 20 mil. Be hard, though, even for... Hey, at least we found the fucking Panzerstreck ambush. Jesus. That could have been bad. I mean, I don't know if I'm supposed to save these tanks, but I could have been bad if, they, if I didn't actually find those guys. Oh, there's a gun right there. Let's kill that. Let's keep firing here. Ducks are doing their job. Let's 
speed these jeep supplies a little bit out of the way if they're empty. The triple mortar on the SIG, it's gonna get wrecked. And it's a tiny mortar and it doesn't really work well in multiplayer, but it works fine in this. Let's get the fuck out of there. And move these guys up. Give them a supply jeep. Let's give them a command if I'm at it. I think, okay, they're still all sloping back there. I'm not gonna really fight with those guys. There's no point. I can find out what, what the flax doing over there. We got our Shermans coming in. Those Donald Duck Shermans. There we go. It took 10 minutes, or I had 10 minutes left, I guess. That was the, uh, that was the timer left on it, but hey, I managed to still do it. Can we push south over here? Okay, no, 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 definitely not, definitely not. Now I'm gonna push him out of the road. Let's get a fifty. Where did shot come from? Where? Right, wow, all the way back there. Fuck off. Oh, the eighth, the eighth airborne, isn't it? Holy shit! There's not, there's not the eighth, is the eighth airborne? I don't know what the mighty eight refers to. I'll be honest, I think it's the eighth airborne. No, I'm probably stupid. Oh, they're just bombing everything. Holy shit sticks, that's all dead. That's going to fuck some people up. It's gonna get a recon going. We got off map go, or we got the shit, the planes coming. We got yeah, vehicles driving up. We can probably deal with all of those guys without any hassle. Like, well, let's deal with these guys with the mortars. Oh god, there's no point. No need. They're all dead. They're all dead before I could even aim for them. Oh, I might lose a deep fifty caliber here. Retreat! Suppress it. Oh shit, I should have done that. That was stupid. Well, at least we can hit these more. We need these units back here. Let's spam them to death. That's literally what that is. MG back there, that's fine. These guys are doing fine. Airborns are fine over there. It's only I'm sure I don't lose any, like, important units. Like, the G50 Cal, really, I don't care, but... Hit that again. Okay, they hit a Ostrupen back there in the town, but, you know, they're just getting absolutely pummeled. We still have some units over there, but those, uh... These guys are dealing with all this stuff over here. It's gonna make sure that they don't actually kill my tank, or the AI tanks, but... Pretty much, they're just getting wrecked right now. Let's push these guys up even more. So I'm gonna make sure that those dumb artilleries aren't actually going to kill a unit before... Oh, the mission's over. Because it'd be a shame to lose a unit just because the AI is like hammering my points for the last like 15 minutes. So you can see, I've definitely hammered them back. It's pretty much a moon landscape out there. It's pretty sad. These things are like really close together though. It's really freaking me out. I'm not just, I actually don't need an extra supply. Let's put this up a little bit more. Is this a little leader still? I'll put a leader right there, and we'll, we'll, we'll know for sure it's fine. Ready to take command. Oh, I still have a jeep right here that I didn't even realize. 81 fire. mils, we're good. Okay, this is all running away from me. Uh, let's just run. I don't really want to wait. I don't really want to waste any units. But. Why don't we just get... Nah, I really don't... I mean, I could spam the engineers, but I want to just make sure I don't actually lose any units. This thing doesn't have heat, does it? I don't think it does. Besides, it's an M16. It's an M15. It's going to suppress the shit out of that in a second, isn't it? It's not hitting it, though. Stop killing the stuff there, you bastards. Move up. 
bastard. Come on, what's your range? 2,000 meters? Okay, it's not that bad, but still, it's not great. Mortar. Oh, these guys are almost dead. Oh, that's retreating now. It's almost fucking... It's almost made to... It's almost panicked to cross that infantry over there. These guys move up a little bit more. I think it's 1,200 meter range for these, so I couldn't start mortaring this light gun. I really don't need to bother with these guys because they'll get wrecked. MGs opening up on my infantry, but... Well... They want to open up, but even before they can, they're going to get demolished anyway by the uh, sheer amount of fuck you 50 cals that the American army has on their vehicles. And now they're just getting in range, and there we go. So, not an easy mission. Uh, definitely very interesting. I like the whole, like, you know, you're fighting by an enemy line situation and the allies starting to come off the beats. Beats? Beach? Um, yeah, I saved six. One, two, three, four. I have read somewhere you can at the very most save eight. So six for the first time isn't actually that bad. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you liked it, drop a like. And if you want to see more, I will obviously be uploading the second mission of this campaign really soon. If you liked the video, like I said, drop a like. We'd love to see you in the next one. Cheers. Bye.